Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In today's video we will be going over on how you could uh, license your uh, package files, your package games basically. So it's pretty simple methods to um, do this. Number one is through monoguns and then the other one is through PSN patch. So we're going to cover all of the methods here. So as you can see I have this game right here, The Evil Within. And when I try to click on it, I, it says this content can be used if you renew the license in PlayStation Store, in the uh, PlayStation Store. So for that, we're gonna uh, put in the USB. So basically, whatever game that you try to download it always has a a wrap file associated with it. So uh, I'm going to be attaching a clip, as you guys can see. What you're going to do is. You're going to go on over to your USB, you're going to make a folder named xdata. Then you're going to take your wrap file and you're going to put it in the xdata file. And you can eject your and then eject your USB and then bring it on over to the PlayStation. Okay, so now I have my USB plugged in, and one way to check if your USB is plugged in or not is to go on over to the video or music section, and you're going to see USB device right here. This means that your USB device has been connected successfully. Okay, so now that your USB is connected and you've done everything right, so we're gonna now go on over to Monoguns. Okay, so now we're in Monoguns right now. So what we're going to do is we're going to press the select button. If you're using a PS4 controller like I am, you're just going to press the share button right here and it's going to open up uh, this tab right here. So what you're going to do is click on dev underscore USB zero zero, and then you're going to go on over to X data, and then you're going to press square, which will highlight it, and then you're going to press on triangle, and then you're going to click on copy. You can do copy or cut, I prefer copy. So now press X on copy, and then you're going to click on these two buttons here and then again and then you're going to go on over to dev hdd0 and then you're going to go on over to xdata right here this folder and you're going to put your wrap file in here by simply pressing triangle and then paste and there you go our wrap file I think this is, yeah, this is the wrap file. And as you can see, it's loaded in. So now we're going to go on over the second method. We're going to go back. Now that we're back at the XMB screen. Now this is different. You, you can also activate your wrap files with PSN patch. So we're going to click on PSN patch right here. Make sure your USB is plugged in. All right, so now that we're here, we're, what we're going to do is we're gonna click on L1. So L1 right here, which says to install RAP plus EDAT. So we're going to click on L1, and then we're going to press start. As you can see, it detected the RAP file, and there we go, we're done. So now we're going to press on circle, and exit out of PSN patch. So now we're going to start the game on X and it's going to load. Now, as you can see, you don't, you don't get the uh, activate you don't get the copyright issue now. As you can see, the game loaded up. There we go. And that is the evil within for you guys. There we go. And that is the game, uh, the evil within. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's tutorial. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe and follow for more. This is me, Mods, signing off.